Let's learn how to add a Draw It to make a graphic organizer or a whiteboard easily available for students to share learning. In the Activity and Content Selector menu, choose Quizzes and Games. Then Draw It and click Add to begin creating a Draw It in your Nearpod lesson. There are three basic steps to creating or editing a Draw It activity. Step 1. Create or edit the prompt or instructions for the activity using the rich text editor at the top of the screen. You can vary the text by size, color, or style, use bullet points, numbers or symbols, and or type math equations. Step 2. Determine which of the additional options you would like to use. Add a background or add visual cues to the workspace for your students. Include a timer to keep the students motivated. Or add reference media to provide additional materials to be used to scaffold or enrich the question. Step 3. Click Save to add the question to your lesson. If this is a new question, you will find it at the end of your lesson and can drag it to the best location. To edit this or any other activity, double-click the activity to start editing. Consider two ways you might use the Draw It activity. The most basic way is to use a Draw It as a digital whiteboard with a traditional paper-based activity as the background. This allows for tracing, drawing, or using a graphic organizer directly in the Nearpod lesson. Another way to use the Draw It activity is to leave the background blank. Encourage students to use all the tools available, such as markers or highlighters, creating text boxes, uploading images, or uploading video to explain a concept or share what they already know or recently learned about a topic. A pro tip for using the Draw It is students can use their own device to take pictures of work they are doing off the device and upload their own picture to the workspace. Students can add text to explain the work they are showing in their picture. 